So here's a story about how this baby raccoon ended up on my boat. So we were sitting on the porch and we noticed something swimming in circles across the lake. And sure enough, we pull up to it and it was this baby raccoon right here. He was struggling. He was just about to give out. He couldn't see where he was going. So we get him in the boat and you can just tell how weak he is. He was, he was struggling to stay above water. <laughs> it's okay, buddy. He starts climbing around. Oh, watch the leather. And he eventually climbs up on the pole and he's hanging on. Got some cool pictures of that. And yeah, he was just loving it. And yeah, he, he waves at the camera right here. We get him back to the dock and he doesn't want to come <laughs> off the pole. So off camera, we grab a little towel and grab onto him and get him off the pole. We bring him up on the dock, and we don't know how he ended up in the water, but he was not going to make it much longer out there. So we let him play around in the yard a little bit, and he growls a few times, and also he's doing that little cry that you can hear. I think it's him calling for his mom. So he ends up hiding underneath of our dock and he stays there for two nights in a row waiting on his mom to come and find him. <laughs> so we decide that we needed to do something because he wasn't eating. He was just staying in one spot, latched on to our dock. So I talked to one of my friends that takes in animals and they decided that they were up for the challenge to take him in and try to raise them up so I let them come and get them.